Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop CC 2021 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to remove braces in Photoshop. Here we go, I've got an original image here, you see here the layer is on. I've made a copy of it and then I did some painting and you'll see here that I started to paint off the braces. Now there are a few ways to do this type of thing. Uh, you can use a clone stamp tool if you've got really nice teeth and you've got a lot of white around the, the braces. You can use a healing spot, healing brush, stuff like that. But the way I like to do it is using the brush tool. So let me show you how I do it. I'm going to delete these two layers and we're going to start off here. So we just drag and drop in here. Girl's got her braces on. The next step is I am going to zoom in a little bit because we're going to be working in up close. So, we've zoomed in a bit. I'm going to take this layer, I'm going to drag and drop it on that plus icon at the bottom. That creates a duplicate layer. Alright, now I'm going to go one step further and I'm going to hit the plus sign and I'm going to create a new layer, but this is not a duplicate, this is just a new blank layer which I will be working on. The step that I want to go to next is you want to go up to your toolbar and you want to find your brush tool. You can hit B to do that, or you can just do what I just did there and get the brush out. Now, at the top, you're going to see a few different options. The one that you want to click on here is the brush, the brush type. Now, I'm going to go, and if you don't see brushes, you can always go down to Window and make sure there's a check mark beside the brushes. And when you do that, it'll open your brushes panel. The one that I use is under General Brushes, and this is the most commonly used one. I'm just going to use a simple soft round brush. That's it. That's all you need to do. I've got the soft round brush, brush selected. I've got the color, which we'll get to in a second. I've got the opacity at 100, and the flow at 30, and the smoothing at 10. All right, good. Now, the brush size is a little small, so I'm going to just increase it a little bit. So I'm just going to hit the right bracket key. Uh, if you're on a Mac, it should be underneath the plus and equal sign. Um, if you're on a PC, I'm not sure because I don't have my PC in front of me. But what you want to do now is once you've got your brush selected, you need to hold down the Alt key if you're on a PC or the Option key if you're on a Mac, and you're going to see that it creates a eyedropper tool. What this means is it's going to be sampling the color that the eyedropper is hovering over. So I am going to sample this color here, which is just outside of the brace and I'm going to left click on it. When I did that, it selected this color here. Now, I'm going to slowly paint over top of it. And you'll see here that I keep selecting a different color. And what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to just make it look a little organic. Now, again, I'm going to zoom in a little further. And again, if this isn't perfect to start, not to panic, we're going to fix it up in a few seconds. But I'm just basically selecting colors that are from the tooth itself. So I'm selecting colors from the tooth and presto, I'm just sort of painting over it. Let's pick some parts down here. Let's pick this part here. I'm just going to paint into here maybe. And you'll see here kind of what I'm doing. Now there are some tricky parts. So I'm going to go ahead and reduce the brush side considerably. And I'm going to zoom way in. And I'm going to go ahead and remove this piece here. So I'm going to sample again the color and I'm just going in I'm going to I'm going to actually going to sample this color here this should be up this is a little bit of a gap here so I'm going to create that and then you'll see here that I'm way in deep on this and I'm going in and I'm removing her braces step by step now again some of these colors aren't quite right so you can always just go in and see you can always eyeball and say hey that doesn't look right and go in and just change the color up so I'm just going to go ahead and Add in a little bit of this, and then when you zoom way out, you'll see here that it looks pretty good. It's not quite perfect, so you can add in if you want it to be a little whiter, maybe. Like, I mean, teeth are never quite perfect, but you can always just go in and adjust that and change the color, change, remove the pieces, remove the braces, so to speak. Let's go ahead and pull that out. I'm going to increase the size of the brush considerably. I'm going to quickly go over it. There you go. Nice and simple. And that is how you remove braces. Now, if you want to go in and add, let's say you go a little too far here, and you take away some of the pink, like I've covered over the pink, just go in and pull in some of the pink. 
and we'll put it back and then we'll slowly add it in and when you zoom out you would never know that there were braces on those teeth guys that is how you do it thank you for watching this tutorial got a lot more stuff coming up stay tuned